Welcome to EPC Land, your trusted platform for in-depth knowledge on piping engineering in the energy sector. I'm Sonia, and with over 20 years of experience in the field, I'm thrilled to share my insights with you today. A special thanks to EPC Land for giving me this opportunity. Today, we are diving into the world of pipe supports, specifically focusing on the variable spring hanger. This component plays a crucial role in supporting pipelines that experience vertical thermal movements. A variable spring hanger is designed with a single spring coil and is used to manage the gravity loads of pipelines as they undergo thermal expansion or contraction. This means that as the temperature changes, the pipeline will either expand or contract, and the spring hanger adjusts accordingly to accommodate these movements. Let's break this down further. Imagine a pipeline that heats up during operation. When the pipeline gets hot, it expands. The variable spring hanger supports the pipe from above and compensates for this expansion. As the pipeline moves from its cold, contracted position to its hot, expanded position, the spring hanger adjusts its load accordingly. This adjustment happens because the spring coil in the hanger is designed to compress or extend as needed. In the cold position, when the pipeline is not yet heated, the spring is in a more relaxed state. As the pipeline heats up and expands, the spring compresses to support the additional load created by the expansion. This helps to maintain proper alignment and prevent excessive stress on the pipeline and connected equipment. Variable spring hangers are essential for systems where pipelines experience significant temperature fluctuations. They ensure that the pipeline remains stable and properly supported throughout its thermal cycle, thereby reducing the risk of damage or misalignment. In summary, the variable spring hanger is a versatile and vital component in piping systems. It supports pipelines by adjusting to thermal movements, ensuring stability and reducing stress on the system. Thank you for watching this video. If you found this explanation helpful, don't forget to subscribe to the EPC Land YouTube channel for more content on piping engineering. EPC Land offers detailed courses on this subject with over 150 hours of recorded lectures, so be sure to check those out as well. Your support helps us bring more valuable content to you. Until next time, this is Sonia signing off. Thank you for joining me and have a great day.